This week in America, unfortunately, we had another terrorist attack. And once again, it was by someone who believed in radical Islam and was influenced by that radical ideology. He was an American citizen, but he was influenced, he was radicalized, and he decided because of that ideology that it was time to kill innocent Americans. Yet our leadership in Washington, in the White House, they don't want to talk about the radical ideology, even though that's the real enemy. Instead, they're making this about gun control, gun control, gun control. But they won't even say what kind of gun control they want. These people bought the guns legally. They would have, if through background checks or anything else, they would have still been able to buy it. There was nothing to say to prevent them. Do you want to ban guns? Is that what you said? How are you going to do that? And most of it is because they want to distract from the real issue. Look, I don't hate all Muslims. In fact, I played audio on the show today from a Muslim who believed in democracy, who believed in reform, and wanted good Muslims to stand up against the bad Muslims and call for reform of Islam throughout the Middle East. That's what's going to have to happen. We ought to have to spread American values, the truth, why America is good, why freedom is good, and why that radical ideology is bad. Until we do that, we're not going to be able to fight the enemy. I talked about this. I talked about gun control, a bunch of other things on the podcast. What you want to do, go to beyondreasonradio.com or you can listen to the podcast on iHeartRadio, on iTunes, a bunch of other places. Go to it, listen, it's important stuff. And we talked about it. And go check out the podcast and then I'll check you out next time on the next live show.